My name is Aves. I've been editing professionally for over a decade and have been editing for content creators for over three years. Today we're talking about an extension called Excalibur that is absolutely essential for anybody that does a lot of repeat edits. I'm looking at you content editors. I just have absolutely so many presets that I am constantly applying to clips. It's not too bad to just click and drag the presets over depending on which preset I want to use. However, it's not the best either. So I did a little digging and I found this extension called Excalibur. My favorite feature is the ability to add keyboard shortcuts to video presets. Saves so much time, and in another video, I'm gonna talk about how I use the Stream Deck to make this even more efficient. There's just so many different things in here that potentially add a lot of really useful keyboard shortcuts. Normally you could search in effects for something like blur and it'd come up with the different blurs, but that's kind of a lot of work and it kind of gets rid of, you know, whatever menus you were in in the effects panel. With Excalibur, all you do is alt space. It brings up the Excalibur dialog. You can type in blur and add whatever blur. So for instance, I added a camera blur there. If I'm gonna make this purple, I can just say label purple and now it's purple. Instead of having to right click, label, and then find purple, and you know, you misclick and hit mango or whatever. That is just a really quick look at Excalibur. It is a really, really great Premiere Pro extension. This one I just feel like is essential for anybody that does a lot of repeat edits. If you're working on a lot of projects that are individual from another and you're not really using presets and stuff, maybe it's not the best, especially if you edit for a streamer. I would highly, highly recommend this extension. There'll be a link in the description down below to check it out, right below that subscribe button. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a comment down below if you have any other Premiere Pro extensions I should check out, and I'll see you guys in the next one.